the reason I advocated for our students to be able to go do this rotation with these osteopaths in Italy was really twofold. First, it was to give them the experience of seeing osteopathy integrated into a hospital system. And second was to see osteopathic research being done in very innovative ways. The future of osteopathic medicine is dependent upon the future of osteopathic research. OMT and OMM are truly the things that make us distinct as osteopathic physician, and we need to be able to do innovative research to show their efficacy. So the future of osteopathic medicine is osteopathic research. The future of osteopathic research is our students, and that is why having them do these meaningful experiences is so important to our profession. Hi, my name is Ethan Kremer, uh, recently graduated from NYITCOM. The first two weeks of our rotation were spent in Milan. Uh, we spent some days in the osteopathic school in Milan. Um, some other days were filled with uh, treating patients in the NICU and the nursery at the Children's Hospital. And then the rest of the time was filled with um, seeing patients in the private clinics um, of the osteopaths that we worked with during the time. But after this experience, I can really see the applicability of um, manipulative medicine in the hospital. And it's really something that I'm going to take into my practice when I start uh, my residency in a couple of months. When we came here, we weren't sure if there was much more to learn when it comes to OMM, because we had gone through four years, we were very confident, but it was shocking the amount um, that we actually learned from the osteopaths um, and the doctors that we worked with over in Italy. My name is Madison Salvetti, and I'm a recent graduate of NYITCOM. The second half of our osteopathic manipulative medicine rotation in Italy was spent in Pescara, Italy with Dr. Francesco Ceratelli. We spent time in Francesco's private practice, as well as had the opportunity to see his research at the University of Chieti, where he is using thermoscan and fMRI to look at how OMT affects the brain. As a future general surgeon, prior to this, I never really was able to, to make the connection between OMT and general surgery, but after spending a month in the hospitals and with Dr. Saratelli, I now am able to see how I can use osteopathy, not only while rounding, but also postoperatively on my patients.